So I feel inspired to offer a meditation contemplation and I want to talk just a little bit about this contemplation before we go into the flow of it. Um, I think that for many of us, including myself, we are struggling with our stress levels and this can be, you know, can give rise to tensions in the body, headaches, and also on the physical level we can have more inflammation, we can have more difficulties, more aches and pains. I notice this a little bit as I get older. And now in the in the yogic tradition there's also this sense of working with the energies of the sun and of the moon. So even this word hatha, hatha yoga, is sort of this word relates to this kind of uniting or connecting to the energies of the sun and of the of the moon. And there's lots of different ways of kind of getting into that. One way is feeling the energy of the sun like the electric and feeling the energy of the moon like the magnetic. Or we can feel into it sort of feeling like the uh, energy of the, the sun is maybe we could feel maybe more the masculine energy of the moon more feminine energy of the sun more active energy of the the moon kind of more <coughs> excuse me more passive or more sort of maybe a little bit more intuitive now one aspect as well as if you're getting sort of your stress levels are getting up and I know this can be an issue for many of us these days we kind of feel like it's it's almost like having an um, an excess of the fire element within our body you know our thoughts can be buzzing and racing and you know you might get start to get more irritated or more angry and in a way on a sort of energetic level we could see this as maybe a sort of imbalance of the fire element within us. Now in the yogic tantric tradition, sometimes the, the navel center, the navel center is very much connected to the sun and the, the head, which we can maybe connect a little bit more with the thinking mind, is connected more with the moon, connecting from the sun, connecting to the moon. and. On the basis of that, I've developed this little practice, this little meditation. Now this meditation, I think it's gonna be quite fun for us to do. It involves a very simple chant, and I've utilized a fairly well-known melody that maybe some of you have already done at different points in your life. You, you may have done a, a chant that goes something like, um, Earth is my body, water is my blood, air is my breath, fire is, you know, that kind of melody. So I've, I've changed the words. And the first half of this sort of meditation is, is about connecting to our fire element within us. So the words that I'm going to suggest that you use to go along with me, the words are fire in my body and then fire in my heart. Fire in my mind, fire makes me start. So if we were utilizing the melody, it'd be something like, fire in my body, fire in my heart, fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart, fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Now I notice when I do that, those words, fire in my body sounds fine, fire in my heart sounds fine, but fire in my mind, fire in my mind has this sort of sense of like almost, oof, I'm not sure about that, it has a sense of kind of, you know, kind of, um, a sort of fire, sort of fiery, sort of almost like a slightly craziness in the, in the head or the mind, a little bit too much fire element. So 
when you do the chant, you'll maybe feel that slight unsureness about the words fire in my mind. But that's intentional in this chant, so don't worry about that. And then the sense of fire makes me start, because the fire element is very much connected to the sense of movement and, uh, and activity and sort of uh, manifestation and doing this as sort of more like electric type energy. So that's the first half of the meditation that we'll do, contemplation together. Now the second half is very much connected to the energy of the moon. And this is such a grace to do. This is such a blessing. And I'm doing this chant a lot at the moment because, you know, I have a lot of sometimes headaches or inflammation a little bit. So, and the moon though is this wonderful kind of sister to the fiery sun, the moon, the lunar energy, the more kind of cooling, calming energy of the moon, the sort of more magnetic, cooling, calming, intuitive, passive, accepting, almost sort of pacifying as well. Okay, so the words for the second part of this meditation words relating to this feeling of the coolness, the calmness, the soothing energies of the moon. So the words are moon magic, which we repeat two times. So it's moon magic, moon magic. And then we say cold moon, cold moon. We, we invite the sense of this cold moon, calming moon to us. So moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Then again, moon magic, moon magic, and then cometh thy cold glow. So the second part of this is moon, moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon, moon magic, moon magic, cometh thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, Cold moon, cold moon, moon magic, moon magic, cometh thy cold glow. So we have these two different halves of the practice. Now when you do the first half of the fire, allow your sense of the fire element sort of moving within you, sort of rising within you. Connect to that within you, really sort of connect to it through connecting to the energy of the fire in the body, the heart. Notice how you feel about saying the words fire in the mind. Fire makes me start. Then we go into the half where we, we can sort of balance this energy of the fire element with the, the lunar qualities of the moon. So we'll begin doing the practice together. If you're not already there, coming into a, a sitting, a, you know, a, a nice posture. Sitting could be on the edge of your sofa, just rocking nicely or cross-legged on a cushion, prayer stool, anything, you know, sitting on a chair is fine as well, but just try to have a sort of sense of yourself being supported, rooted, a uh, sense of the spine rising up through the, through the air, S slightly tucking in the chin, keeping the neck, back of the neck long, and we'll begin this practice together. When you're doing this practice, feel you're doing it with others. Other people will be watching this contemplation. Don't worry about your voice too much if it's in tune. You know, that's not the priority here. The priority is the intention. You know, I have no, by no means a perfect voice, but what does that even mean to have a perfect singing voice? The important thing is that the effort, listen, tune in, project the energy, feel the emotion, connect to the practice. So we'll begin. Fire in my body, fire in my heart, fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart, fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart. Fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart. Fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart. 
Fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart. Fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart. Fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Fire in my body, fire in my heart. Fire in my mind, fire makes me start. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon. Cold moon, moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Moon magic, moon magic, cold moon, cold moon. Moon magic, moon magic, come with thy cold glow. Just carry on in your own time doing the chan. Allow yourself to sway and move. Don't take it too overly seriously. Have a sense of the playfulness of the practice. Have a sense of the... Allow yourself to feel that cooling, calming, lunar energies of the moon. We're not just talking about the external moon here. We're talking about these energies within your body, within your psyche. Of course, also including the external reality. But we're really kind of focusing on our own energy system here. How we feel internally. We're working with the fire element. We're kind of stoking the fires. But we're also allowing the pacifying energies of the moon. Connecting from the navel center, the fiery energies of the digestive system and the gags of the circulation and we're connecting it, cooling it through the mind and the energies of lunar moon. So carrying on the practice now out loud, carrying on the words, feeling the energy of it, feeling it within your system. Now beginning to, to make the chant a little bit quieter, beginning to soften it. Let's bring it down to a whisper together. So let's carry on together. Not sure if you can hear me whispering, but just carry this chant on, doing it a few times for the fire, and then doing it a few times for the moon, the cooling energies of the moon. Let's carry on the vibration of the chant, just doing it silently within your heart mind. Just doing it within yourself. So just saying it, but saying it within your mind, saying it just to yourself.
Now let's all together rest in the silent beauty of the the sound of no sound, just the inner vibration within yourself, feeling the effects of the practice, having a sense of the journey you've been on through the practice, sense of connection to the others doing this practice together. And you can also experiment with this practice at home, utilizing it when you feel you need to, when you feel this two sort of inflamed sort of energies rising within you. So thank you everyone for joining me on this practice, bringing your awareness really back into your body, beginning to move fingers and toes, really integrate your awareness back into the flow of kind of kind of normal grounded waking awareness bring movement back to your physical body opening your eyes thank you so much for everyone joining me on this practice it's special for me to be able to offer these meditations to you all